Just before the pandemic, when I was still living in London, I purchased myself an iZettle card reader. I just made it onto the overground busking scheme and uh, I was planning to take donations via card. Sensible option, right? Well, the pandemic hit and I've moved to another part of the country and I'm back into the busking and this thing has been sat in my drawer for 18 months. So I got it out and thought, gonna start busking, gonna start taking donations. <coughs> Can't do it. The only way you can take donations as a busker with iZettle is if you have an iPhone. That's right. iZettle have a function called repeat pay, all right? And what that means is you can set it up and you can say, set it at two pounds and then people will come along, tap two pounds, next person, tap two pounds, next person, tap two pounds. Because obviously in the middle of your busking set, you don't want to sit there and go, oh, two pounds, yeah, okay, I'm just gonna stop mid-track and oh, two pounds, yeah, and I'm just gonna stop mid-track and two pounds, yeah, thanks for your donation. Doesn't really make for cohesive busking, does it? Okay. <laughs> It's only available on Android. I got in touch with iZettle regarding this matter, and this is what they had to say. Hello, Aaron. Thank you for contacting Zettle by PayPal. Your request is actually something I've frequently forwarded to our technical department. However, we are yet to receive any updates if and when this feature will be implemented. I can only speculate this has to do with app development for iOS being easier than for Android. In similar cases, what I have also suggested was the following. I'll activate the feature from our end for you anyway, and anytime you can get an iOS device, you can use it. I know it's far from being an ideal solution, but really is the only workaround I can suggest for you. So, okay, customer service, fair play to this guy, Joel. He's He's been pretty cool, and customer service did get back to me within two days, which is awesome. I really like that about uh, Zettel. But I still don't have the feature now. I tried working around this, okay, in two ways, I got in contact with various other card companies, none of which even offer a repeat pay function, <laughs> which is, you know, good for Zettel in some ways, I guess. But um, the other way I tried to get around it was I went into my local secondhand phone dealership and I was looking at secondhand iPhones and I saw an iPhone, was it a five for about 80 quid? And I thought, well, if I offset against the price of donations, I'd probably make that back quickly-ish. However, this is where Apple screwed me over because Apple iPhones, apparently, according to the person in the phone shop, their software becomes redundant um, unless you've got up to a certain model. So I think iPhone 6 would have been valid, but iPhone 5, I wouldn't have actually been able to download any apps. So I couldn't do it that way either. And I'm not willing to pay um, 300 pounds for a second hand iPhone just to use this feature because I don't think people should have to do that. I think that's completely unreasonable and ridiculous and all Apple products are overpriced for what they are. Sorry if you're an Apple user, that's just my personal opinion. Feel free to slate me in the comments below. Um, <laughs> but it's 2021 and he said that this feature isn't available because of the difficulty of developing the app for Android he imagines. Well, yeah, I don't really buy that in 2021. In 2021, if you've got enough money, you can pay to go to space, right? I don't believe there isn't a single developer that can get this one function working on Android. I just don't buy it. The actual iZettle works with Android, okay? But you just don't have that one feature where you can take donations. So you're yeah, very, very disappointed. I also know that this has been an issue for at least a year. There's a busker, a very popular London busker by the name of Charlotte Campbell. Go check her out, she's very, very good. And in her video on YouTube, she says the same thing. It's not available on Android. And that video was posted, to my memory, July or August of 2020. That means the issue is a year old at least. So iZettle, you need to sort your shit out. You need to sort it, okay? This is a, a unique little gap in the market right here. And all of those little 1.5% that you make back on the donations, you're missing from me because I refuse to buy an iPhone, which I shouldn't have to buy in the first place. Please, 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 can you develop this feature? It cannot be impossible if you're a developer. Maybe you can get in touch with iZettle and offer them to do it for them. <sighs> now I can breathe. Thank you if you've made it all the way to that. If you've had a similar experience with a card reader machine or this machine, or if you've had this exact experience, get in touch with the comments below because, you know, we want to start a bit of a fire and hopefully we can change something. <laughs> all right, thanks for watching, bye.